Hello everybody and welcome back to my Until Dawn Let's Play. Let's continue, shall we? Shit. Fuck, Mike. What? Oh, crap. What? Where is it? What? What's wrong? Gone. It is gone, okay? Just slow down. What is gone? My freaking phone, Sherlock. Can you find it? Crap, no. I must have dropped it outside. Oh, shit. I can't lose my phone. My parents will kill me. You can always get a new one. That's like my fourth one this year. Okay, okay. Well, I'll have you look for it. It's got to be outside. Yeah, I don't think we want to go out there right now with the bear or whatever it is. <sighs> Fine. Looky, looky. Who's going to fire up some nookie? You've been dying to use that line since we got here, haven't you? All right, before romancing Jessica, let's have a little nose around this cabin, shall we? Yep. Nice. We're doing that this will because up the mood a little. Why not? Oh! Ah! Hey, why are you okay? What are you doing? It's it's the lights. I know it's the lights, dummy. You broke them. Uh, it's probably faulty wiring or something. You've got faulty wiring. Like I've said before, every clue matters. Even if it seems so small, literally every clue you find will be either mentioned or come into use later on, so it is very vital to find as much as you physically can. Shut up, Jess, I'm talking. Jess, you get a fire going. Pronto. Oh, hell yeah. These guys were inventive. Wow. I'm not sure if I'm ready for such advanced levels of game play. As always, if you want to read any of that, just pause the video. What do you think was in there, Mike? Come on. <sighs> All right, you moany bitch, I'm on my way. Time to romance and all that. Be perfect gentlemen. Get your kit off. It's so cold in here right now, my tongue will get stuck to your flagpole. Ah, this will take care of the mood lighting. Let's get Fire it on, one. shall we? Fire zero. Very nice. Bravo. All right, my lady. What comes next? <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Uh, uh, uh. <sighs> <sighs> Now, please. 
Okay, Jessica took her kit off quite quickly. One minute she's wearing clothes, next minute she's in underwear. I didn't even see her take her clothes off. And yet Mike is still wearing his jeans and his vest off. Okay then. It's your phone. What? How is it my phone? I don't know, it just came through the window. Oh, for fuck's sake, god damn it. What? Those goddamn assholes probably followed us out here to fuck with us and just when we were getting down to business. <sighs> they were if I wish they weren't. I guess we should find out. Josh looked really freaked out at the seance. Yeah, I mean, he, he looked like he was keeping it together, but... Do you think we shouldn't have mentioned his sisters? I mean, it's why we came back up here. Yeah. But not to, like, have a seance. Maybe we went too far. Mom, did, did you see that? Yeah. But the power's not even on. Weird. Just like with the Mike and Jess relationship, I think I mentioned this in the previous video. I honestly can't remember, but anyway, I'm gonna... Damn it. Damn it. ...play the Chris-Ashley relationship a certain way which may or may not sort of relate to the same as what Sai did and the only reason it is because his outcome again will be different to mine but if I want to do a different outcome to what Sai did I have to play the relationship more or less the same way otherwise if I don't the outcome will be too much the same and we don't want that Are you okay? I think so Look! What? There was something behind the box What is that? Is it a button? Why would there be a button? That's a good question. Should I push it? That's what buttons were for, I guess. Whoa, panel opens. Head explodes. Are we, like, in a movie right now? If we are, I hope it's a rom-com. Leave it to the Washingtons to have secret passages in their house? I mean, maybe they didn't even know. This place is super old. So... Should we take a look? Yeah, after you. No, 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 no. You go. <laughs> Gee, thanks. Okay, I had the mic muted just then, but that spider made the made me jump the fuck out. Whoa, uh, I hate. I, I'm an arachnophobic. I hate spiders. Get the fuck off my screen. Whoa, is what this... did you find? Holy cow. Now, now Ash, I, I, I don't want to freak you out, but, but look at this. What? Chris, what is that? I, I think this might be what the spirit board wanted us to find. The clue? Yeah, it's a letter. Let me see it. It's a, a threat. Chris, this is serious. We need to find Josh right now. Um, 
what's behind door number one? Okay, I don't want to go there. What's behind door number two? Oh, there's no door number two. Never mind. Hannah and Beth? But there is a clue so, here. That would be really messed up. Why do they talk every time I want to talk? God damn it. Anyway, as always, pause the video if you want to read all this. If you see me wandering around like a headless so, chicken, that's because um, I don't want it. I've just been thinking about something I saw earlier with Sam. What? It, there was like this wanted poster, like full on Western style, you know? So? And Sam really thought there was someone following her around. So, so what you're saying, there's some criminal up on the mountain with us? There was a message on this answering machine I found, and it. It, it was from this sergeant saying that there was this guy who had just gotten out of prison and that there was nothing he could do. Well, what do you mean? He was saying it like, like a warning. I mean, maybe that's whoever was down in the basement before. What? Under the floorboards in the library, the light. Well, there was that guy I told you well, about. Wait, 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 what guy? The guy who threatened the Washingtons. I mean, he, he said he wanted to take revenge by burning the whole place down. And then I found that crazy psycho letter. Chris, if this is your way of trying to make me feel better, you're fired. You hear that? That was Josh! Coming from the kitchen. Josh! Josh! Coming! Hold on! Ashley! Ashley, what's going on? Look in! Ashley! Are you okay? Um. Ash? Ash? Hey. Alright, well, before all that dialogue, I said hang on a minute because I was about to say something and then they started talking and I can't for the life of me remember what I was about to say, so never mind. But anyways. I wonder who that is. I'm going to show you some uh, pictures of people that you have come to know. Alive. But maybe you don't like them as much as you pretend to. Well, this is an exercise in honesty. Tell me which person from each pair you like the most. Take your time, your answers are important. Oh yay, the fun part of picking people. Uh, I prefer Sam. Oh, and uh, I completely forgot that that would show up on the screen, so whoops. Daddy Scott was in uh, my headset the whole entire time during this video, but you didn't hear her. But yeah, she was here, so shout out to Danny Scott. I prefer Matt. Ooh, this one's a toughie. I do prefer Ashley. Yeah, I uh, yeah I prefer Ashley. Uh, another toughie. Uh, mostly because I don't like either of them that much. But I'd say I prefer Mike. Ooh. 
Oh, uh, uh, Josh, I guess. Chris. Tell me, in this little game you're playing so diligently, who is it that you most dislike? Okay, a slightly easier question. I dislike Emily the most because she's a fucking bitch. A bit too bitchy for your taste. Often the lack of confidence manifests itself as overconfidence. Think about that. Is that not just a little bit like... Once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. Hold on! There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. Apparently, he had warned them against pursuing their construction project in Blackwood Pines and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. S. I. S. T. Sister? Ask it whose sister? Josh, it's, it's gotta be. Which sister is it then? Ah! Run! Ah! Oh. oh my god. Ash! here. Will I save Jessica? We'll find out next time. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all next time.